Hey, what's up, you guys? WWE Fan 0599 here again. And welcome back to WWE Fans TV Recap Show. And today's recap show will be for The Muppets. This episode is entitled Pigs in a Blackout. Now, if you have not seen this episode, please do not watch this review because it's going to have spoilers. So, if you have not seen it, don't watch this review. But, if you have seen the episode, if you just don't care about spoilers, continue on watching. So, what this episode is basically about, it's about, you know, Kermit. He goes, he, he's stressed out. So, what he does is he goes to this spa for about, I don't know, a few days. And he leaves Walter in charge. However, when you leave Walter in charge, it's not good at all. But, so yeah. So, what I think of this episode? I really like this episode, you know. It's a really good episode. I really enjoyed this episode. This was a really good episode. Not a great episode, but I still really enjoyed it. It still was a nice, really good episode. I still really enjoyed this episode, so yeah. So let's get into my positives. And my positives are... The acting with the episode, the acting was really good with the episode, I thought everyone did a really good job in this episode, you know, so yeah, I just really enjoyed everybody in the episode, everybody did a really good job, the acting was really good, you know, the comedy was really, really funny, um, you know, not, like, hilariously funny, but it was still funny, like, it wasn't like laugh out loud moments, but I still thought it was funny, so yeah, it was funny, um, the writing was really good, I thought the writing was really good with the episode, you know, very good writing in my opinion. The directing was really good. I thought the, the directing was really good with this episode. You know, some really good directing. So yeah. thought the directing was good. So yeah. Let's talk about some of the moments that happened in this episode. Because there were a lot of moments that happened in this episode. First, the opening. The opening was so, was probably the funniest moment of the entire episode. You know, we see chaos in Sue. One of the Muppets runs into like a butter truck. Butter's all over the place. Miss Piggy's stuck in an elevator. The elevator goes all the way up. Fondy falls through the empty elevator shaft. Kermit faints. It was really funny. I think it was by far the funniest moment of the episode. So yeah, it was just really funny. Uh, really, uh, Probably my favorite opening so far of this season. So yeah. Then when we see, you know, Kermit go to the spot and he leaves Walter in charge. Walter decides to turn the uh, air on. Yeah, kind of already making a bonehead decision because... The the pipe goes through the wall and it burst. And it burst is right um right to um what's it? Beaker. Beaker's frozen now. <laughs> He's like frozen. And w Walter's like and just walks away. <laughs> Very funny. I really enjoyed that too. Um, you know, when we see Kermit at the spot place, Jason Bateman shows up and Jason Bateman's like, you know, I need your help. I need like a costume designer, whatever, whatever. And it was just, it was just pretty funny. You know, he was just like, you know, I don't, I don't got time right now. We're doing something, you know. So yeah, we'll get into that much later. Then when we see, you know, Walter, everything's becoming a disaster. The lights burst out. Piggy's clothes are destroyed. You know, just everything is becoming a disaster. And, you know, and Gonzo's like, don't give up, dude. Just don't give up, you know. Uh, you can do this. So, and I really like that. You know, Gonzo was there for him. He was like, you know, don't don't give up on this. You know, keep on keep on doing it because you can do it. So, yeah. Then when we see back at the spa, you know, Jason Bateman's like, come on, let's just sneak over. And they can't use phones. So, Kermit's like, I can't use a phone. I can't contact anybody. But he does it anyway. He doesn't want to. Uh, he wants to help him out. So... But then the teacher catches them with the phone and Jason Bateman just puts the blame all on Kermit and poor Kermit. He had, he gets kicked out. He has to go back to the work. Go back to work. So yeah. Then when we see in the final moment of the episode, we see, you know, the show's, you know, uh, Walter had everything under control. He and Kermit returns back from work. You know, he's like, I love my job. You know, sure, it stresses me out, and but I just love it. And then when we see in the, like, the final moment of the episode... We see, you know, he, probably my favorite moment of the episode, he sings his famous famous song, over the, I think it's called Over the Rainbow. And uh, it was just so great. I, I felt, I I felt, I, I just, joy inside me was, there was really some joy inside me because hearing that song, man, it was just great. You know, hearing him sing it again, it was awesome. I loved it. So, yeah. 
But I do have some negatives, however, with this episode. My negatives are the whole Sam Eagle and, you know, having the crush on the band, on the girl in the band. I was like, eh, it, it was funny in that episode four because of what was going on. But in this episode, I just thought it was very forced and it just didn't really flow well. So, yeah. Um... You know, there were some, uh, there were some, like, eh, worthy moments, and just, I just thought there were some eh, worthy moments, like, like, funny moments. There were just, like, the funny moments weren't, like, eh, didn't really work, so yeah. And finally, Jason Bateman, I didn't really think he was that good of a celebrity cameo in this episode, you know. Sure, he had some funny moments here and there, but definitely the weakest out of the celebrity cameos so far, so yeah. So it's time for my official grade on this episode, and my official grade on this episode is a B+. Plus. I really enjoyed it. It was a really good episode, so yeah, I enjoyed it. So what do you guys think of this week's episode? Leave it in the comment section below. And I'm WWE Fan 0599, and we'll see you out later. Peace.